Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how I did this in Sony Vegas. Let's get right into it. I was walking with the ghost. It is very important to have a background that is not moving. If you're doing it outside, make sure to record the video pretty fast. So here, I have a non-moving background, which is perfect. And remember, I have a good tripod, which is not gonna move at all. I'm gonna back up, this is where I want to be. And then just jump, like this. And then run off the video, run out of the video. So, you just have the background. Keep it on for like five, 10 seconds, depending how long it took you to jump. So then, now, you can turn it off. And let's get into the editing stage. Okay, so right now I'm using Sony Vegas Pro 13. And let's just drag the clips we took um, into Sony Vegas. You don't need this right now. It's just the introduction and stuff. And let's get to the part where I am about to jump. Um, okay, so let's couple, go back a couple frames. That's where I'm jumping. Oops, my mouth is. My mouth, my mouse. I'm crazy. Okay, so we're gonna stop it right as I come down. My belly button. <laughs> okay, that's, that's that's about right. And then let's go until I get off the screen. Perfect. There we go. So we just have the two clips of me being of me jumping and me being off screen. Let's just get to the part where I. Stop being off screen. Um, it's about like right here. Okay, boom. So we have these two clips, yeah. Me jumping and me not in the frame at all. Okay, so. Um, we don't need the audio, so I'll just delete track. Okay, so we have this. It's kind of laggy right now. Sony Vegas is that to me sometimes. Let's just make this bigger for you guys. Okay, perfect. Sorry if you hear airplanes, because whenever I want to record a video, there's airplanes. Okay, so, um, okay, this is, okay, so you're gonna wanna go come here, click on the track, and right click, and click insert video track, and drag it below the, the one with the clips. Then take the clip of um, nothing in the background under um, the clip of you jumping. So that's all you need to do. Okay, so now let's um, watch it. Okay, so yeah. Okay, so as you can see, once it's done, it just cuts to the background. So we wanna find where I'm highest. So let's just um, go to the next frame where I'm highest and want to start coming down so it's around here with my belly button okay right here you can even see my sock okay so we're gonna cut it and that's the end so just me jumping that's all just super high up now we're gonna take it take that take this just the frame of me being at the highest point and click on this thing, save snapshot to file. Boom. It basically takes a screenshot of, of what you're seeing. So, um, I don't, ha you should have project media here, but I don't, I tend to find it annoying. So let's take the image from my desktop and bring it over here. So, yes, yeah, so we have, boom. And then just the image of me jumping, right? Okay, perfect. So, uh, in this image, we're gonna um, click at the very beginning, at the very beginning, and click on this, which is, um, is it event pan and crop. Okay? And then it should come over here. Let's make this bigger. Perfect, okay. So let, let's zoom in using our mouse scroll. And you, you would wanna click on mask and click the check mark. Now, we're just basically, imagine you're at school, you wanna cut out something, so just cut
cut out yourself. So if you click on this thing, and you just want to outline yourself. I'm going to do, oh god, that's not even close, my mouse, god, okay. Um, so you just want to give yourself an outline. Um, you don't have to do between the legs, that's fine. Take my belly button on fleet. Okay, so we want to do that. And then, um, I will cut into, um, until I am done. So you just keep, yeah, just keep doing it and see that. So I'm coming to the end, and we went around, so let's zoom out, boom, boom, and boom. So now we have just the outline. And, okay, so let's go back to just the actual frame. So if we didn't have this um, background below it, it'll just be the, it'll be just be us. Just the picture of, not us, me, you. Just a picture of you um, in the air. That's why we have the background. So basically, it's almost like a green screen kind of. So you have a background and just you moving. So, so let's watch this. Okay, so you can notice a, a little bit of a light difference because of my shadows, because my shadow's gone. Okay, so now let's um, zoom in pretty close because we want like a good, so we can delete the rest of this. We don't need this. Okay, so we want to click on the beginning of this tr track, um, uh, yeah, of the video. Click event, and then go to um, position, right. So then I like to come here and make this just move in Y only, so just straight up. Yeah, we want it just to look like, woo! -hoo! Okay, let's go back, okay. So, um, go on the first keyframe, and let's um, move this up almost to the be um, belly button, which is just a little bit above the um, pants line, okay? Let's go two frames over, one, two. Now let's go to the, let's go to the knees. Let's go halfway, halfway between the knees and the feet. Then keyframe one, two, and then we're out of the picture. Okay, and we're done. So let's see, not done with the whole thing, but let's just look at this. I'm gonna jump. Boom, it's kind of laggy, because we've done a lot so far. And it's, yeah, so boom, 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 boom. Okay, perfect. So we can um, exit out of this. And so let's just go, boom, okay, since we're out of the frame, we can cut everything out after that. Boom, so we have this. Now, go to your video effects and click on Gaussian Blur, okay? And then click on um, Extreme Blur over and just click it and drag it over here. It should make it super blurry. So just go to the horizontal range and drag it all the way there. We want a big vertical blur. So I like to do it not so much. Like that. So when basically when I'm when I'm jumping, you see the like it's like super fast blur. So let's see that. Okay. So it's kind of slow, right? So if you want to, take the clip, hold control, and then it's just a time stretch, and just drag it left. This makes the clip faster. Let's let's see that. Okay, that's perfect. I like that. Okay, so it's faster. And I like it, it's blurry. So yeah, now we're technically done, but that's kinda, the sound is pretty boring. Oh, yikes. Okay, so I downloaded this sound effects pack. Um, let me drag it over here, um, go to music, and I have all sound effects. This is all my sound effects. Yeah, it's, it's really weird, and I look at the whoosh, the whoosh push and I might put a download link and I probably will okay I'll be nice so let's just I don't know the exact ones I like but just listen to them um that didn't sound good at all I don't know if you can hear that um no that's fine I guess whoosh number one for me okay so 
I'm gonna send this to you guys um, in the description. So we're gonna take it and drag it, oops, drag it all the way to Sony Vegas. So look, so we're gonna drag where the biggest sound is to where we have the jump. So let's listen to this. That's, that's, that's perfect. I like that. So that's technically it. It's a short clip. Um, this is what this is what I did, and yeah, I made it look better. And you might leave the audio in here, um, but yeah, I like that a lot. And yeah, um, if you if I helped you guys, let me know in the comment section below. And if you want more tutorials, um, let me know and tell me what I should teach you guys. So yeah, that's all. Thank you. Bye.